Well, it's the end of an era for BSU hockey. After 45 years on the job, longtime Zamboni driver Vance Ballstead made his last trip around the ice in the Beavers' season finale recently. Lakeland News intern Michelle Whitkin has the story. As Vance Ballstad took his last ride over the weekend, he reflected on how much BSU hockey meant to him, and those working closely with him reflected on their fond memories. I started driving Zamboni a couple years ago with Vance. Um, I kind of took over the role here. I'm in charge of the ice, and you know, Vance has been a mentor to me, uh, full of knowledge, uh, great guy, great personality, fun to work with. We'll continue to have Zamboni riders because it's great for fan interaction. It probably won't be like it was this year where it's always me and Vance. It'll be me and the second personal kind of change with experience and as the season goes. It's been a major part of my life for all these years, uh, watching these young men uh, come in as high school kids uh, or uh, junior kids and progressing and making a, a tremendous career for themselves. It's been a great life. I've really enjoyed it. I guess what I'm going to miss is, is being so close to the action. Um, you're right along the glass all the time. You're working with the, with the people around you, and I'm going to miss the interaction. Next year, I'm going to buy uh, season tickets for both my wife and myself. She's been sitting in the bleachers. I've been down by the glass. To quote Coach Saratori, Vance Ballstad was a staple to the program, and he will be missed dearly. Signing off at the Sanford Center, I'm Michelle Whitkin. Yeah, anybody who's been around BSU Athletics knows Vance, a real good guy. He, uh, he's also the equipment manager back right. in the day when I was playing football there. And uh, certainly will be missed, but he'll still be around. He's been a Zamboni driver there for BSU since 1974. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.